What is up everybody? We're going to Savannah. Yep, Savannah, Georgia. It is a two hour and two minute drive up to Savannah. And if you guys don't know anything about Savannah, it's very similar, yes, yeah, very similar to St. Augustine, Florida. I'm gonna let you know when she needs to come to church and bring a gas basket. It, sm it smells because of- a lot of people say, I can't live here, I couldn't fit it here. All this on the side of the highway is swamp. So we are now traveling through downtown Savannah, which was founded on February 2nd, 1733. So now we are leaving this underground parking structure. Yeah, we're underground, baby. They got high-tech bathrooms here. You gotta type in this toad to get into the bathroom. <laughs> We're gonna be trying uh, Paula Dean's uh, restaurant, which I got a GPS it again because I had to circle this damn place a million times just to find a parking spot. So now we're on the way to find that restaurant. I got it on my GPS. And like I said, this is downtown Savannah. So if you guys wanna know how this trip all came about is, I woke up this morning and I was like, hey, I wanna go somewhere. I don't wanna go anywhere in Florida and it's only two hours to Savannah. So I decided to get up, get in the car because I got paid and I'm up here in Savannah and we're gonna be looking at all the shops and the stores and uh, trying this Paula Deen uh, restaurant and see what it's all about because uh, I heard a guy at work told me this is flavorful, it's, it's flavorful and it's really delicious. So we'll see exactly uh, what Savannah has. We're only gonna be up here for a couple of hours. It's basically like Southern fried uh, food. Like you get, uh, you can get like um, crab cakes, uh, chicken pot pies, you can get chicken salad. Yeah, that kid's freaking out. So on February 12, 1733 is when the city of Savannah was uh, founded and was made like a colony. So it's not as old as St. Augustine, but it's still a very historical city. And everything here is made of brick and everything here looks like very small towns like you see on TV and stuff. So. Savannah is a very, very historical city. Over 200 years old. If you guys haven't checked it out, I definitely recommend you guys taking the drive to come to Savannah, especially if you're in Florida. It's only a couple hours away. So Burnett Street in Savannah, Georgia has a lot of pubs, a lot of art, and just a lot of places to hang out and grub. But it's mainly known for the, the, the bar scene and that's what you see around here is a lot of bars and a lot of people just hanging out and walking around with beers. Yeah, people walk the streets with beers. You know what's unique about what we're walking through? This is the Helton Hotel with like a huge walkway. So everything you see in this street is pretty touristy, meaning everything is hyped way up in price because you can get those tourists to buy anything that says savannah on it maybe one shot glass might be 10 bucks when you could technically get it like at walmart
that is basically River Street. Like I said, that's pretty much River Street in all its glory. There's stuff I've seen in there that I wouldn't mind getting, like, my family and uh, whatnot. But at the price that they're charging, it's not even worth it. And see the city for all what it has, you know. This is River Street, which is basically equivalent to uh, downtown uh, downtown St. Augustine, where uh, you have all the little shops, you have the historical district. Then you have downtown, which has uh, a lot of pubs, a lot of... Uh, restaurant and the main reason why I, like I said I came down here is just to get away from town for the day and when I, it's my day off and I haven't been on like a, a technically a road trip in a while so I decided I'm gonna ask my brother if he wants to do anything and he said sure so we're up here just enjoying Savannah and what Savannah has to offer and I'm sitting right here in front of the uh, uh, riverfront which is a, a very beautiful uh, thing it's around what time is it like it's gotta be like five six o'clock I only paid for uh, like an hour and a half of parking because I'm not gonna pay so much money because it's like two bucks an hour so I paid five bucks but um it is 440 we should be back home probably around I would say seven or eight the way I drive haha -ha. I ain't speeding I'm just cruising haha -ha. but uh and this is all for you buddy this dude's mobbing The first stop on the way home, had to get some small water. Two hours ago, oh my god, you almost hit somebody! Damn, damn, these people out here in Savannah drive like savages. I almost been hit twice. to go until we get back into uh, Jackson. These road trips, these travels are one of my passions in life. Just got back into Jackson. See this thing? <laughs> it's either blue cheese with wings or go fuck your mother. <laughs> That's the next shirt. Ha <laughs> Bring a ranch with Joey Diaz, that comedian. He says ranch t is like tasting like ass. He says you got to be like a hillbilly to be eating that stuff because it tastes like ass. I don't know about that, man. I think ranch is pretty good.